We picked up a lot of neuropazine while we were in the Church of the Singularity just now. In fact, right now we're sitting on a neuropazine hoard, and if I remember correctly, the vendor nearby sells Praxis kits. If we're going to get access to all of our orgs, having some extra Praxis is exactly what we need. You want Praxis, eh? I might be interested. Just doing a bit of forward thinking here. One org I intend to activate needs this ammo. I'll go into that later though. That's it. <laughs> Big spender. Fires could have been started by almost anything. I'm telling you, it was arson. You're paranoid. Well, we're not going in this way. No guesses for which local crime organization could be behind this one. Luckily, we can reach Cola's dungeon via the sewers here. Things with Otar aren't going so well, Jensen. Sorry about your place, Kohler. Are you alright? Physically, yes. Emotionally, I... I just kinda... You know I actually had some real good books up there. The bookstore was kind of a front, sure, but it was my front. The version of me I presented to the world. That... That means something. It means whatever deal you thought you had with the Diwalis is apparently off. My deal? Right. There's something you're not telling me about why Otar's got it in for you. Maybe he is just angry, you know? He takes it out on me because... because I'm prettier than he is. Or maybe he just really doesn't like books. It's possible, right? Look, let's just optimize that rig of yours, huh? You got the neuroplasticity calibrator for me or what? He's not a very convincing liar, is he? Let's probe a little deeper here, and listen carefully to what he says, and compare it to how he was at the start of the game. I know you may not want to talk about what happened to your store. I get where you're coming from, okay? But try to understand, Jensen. I'm a guy who likes to respect privacy. Especially if the other person is someone who can kill me. Which is real good for you, actually. It goes both ways. You're willing to ignore what happened? I am trying to protect myself. Maybe next time they don't just burn the store, huh? I rely on you, Kohler. And I'm willing to help if I can. I don't want to have to identify your remains next time I come in for a tune-up. Neither of us want that. But sometimes... It's better to sweep the ashes under the rug. Kohler's character has done a complete 180 here. He certainly wasn't respecting Adam's privacy at the start of all of this. He's freaking out about something. You can't hide forever. What are you going to do when Otar comes back? 
What do you expect from me? I am tangled up with these people now. This is what I get for saying yes to Radich. But what choice did I have? What choice do I have now? Your choice is to tell me what the hell is going on. What does Otar want from you? He... He wants to know what I know about Radich. That Radich is... That Radich needs me. The way you need me, Jensen. You understand? Radich is augmented. The head of the Diwali man. If Otar finds this out, if any of the Diwali finds this out, they are not very open-minded about these things. Yeah, I get it, Kohler. So what are you gonna do? When augmented people ask for help, I help them. I continue to help Radich. So, the Diwali boss is augmented. That's quite a revelation. Anyway, let's get this calibrator fitted. Alright. Please, tell me this is what a neuroplasticity calibrator looks like. That's the one! Okay, this won't take long, I promise. And don't worry, man, I never screw up two in a row. Spent a lot of time prepping for this one. Just try not to take anything. That wasn't so bad, right? How do you feel? I feel fine. I feel lighter. I fixed you. Death to all your limits. Whatever implant you want to activate, you activate. Zero consequences. That sounds pretty good. Thanks, Kohler. I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just get out there and make me proud. Go make use of all that cool shit. Alright, now to apply Praxis without limits. First up, I'll be activating and fully upgrading the Tesla Augment. It operates like the stun gun, but has a greater range and can target four separate enemies at once. It's what I needed the ammo for from earlier. I'll also be activating and fully upgrading the Titan Org. It makes you invulnerable, but it's an energy vampire of an Org, even when it's fully upgraded. But it's nice to have an insurance policy on this kind of difficulty. Now, on to find Dobra Miller, Vincent Black's informant. Her meeting place is around here somewhere. I want to make sure I wasn't followed. I think it is safe for us to talk here. Finally, together we can make Vlasta pay. Vlasta, your husband. What's this about exactly? You said you have information. Smuggling. Weapons. Drugs. Horse. You name it, darling. All of it is heading east. I have the address of the locker where everything is stored, and I have the code to get in. You will see for yourself, and then you will do what you think is best. You want me to shut down your husband's smuggling operation? Why? I agreed to sell out my husband in exchange for a new life. Vince and I were still... negotiating the details. You are looking for Vince, trying to pick up his trail. I guess I am negotiating with you now. Even now, we're still walking around the middle of this situation, not fully understanding what's going on. Maybe we should get some more info on who we might be going up against here. 
What else do I need to know about your husband? Lester is like all young Diwali. You cannot argue with them. You cannot intimidate them. You cannot appeal to their heart. All he cares about is delivering on time. And chasing after women who are not his wife. Is that why you want to get back at him? Because of something he's done to you? I... I have no illusions about who I married. I knew he was... ambitious. Eager to please the wrong kinds of men. But I didn't think he would turn into this... this monster. I want him to test failure. To have to walk home with his tail between his legs. If I get involved in this, there's a chance he might not walk home at all. What you do with the information I sell you is up to you. All I care about now is starting over. All right, this information you have, how much do you want for it? The price of a ticket to Berlin. With enough left over to start my new life. That is what Vince and I had agreed. They say Berlin is a good city for those wanting to be lost. Oh, well that's convenient. That explains the train ticket we found in Vince's office. If it gets us the intel we need, she can have it. Here. The ticket's already been bought. Open-ended. You leave when you want. Alright. Thank you. My husband owns a storage locker next to the Palisade Bank. The code is 2565. It is the centerpiece of his operation. I hope you find what you're looking for. Delara, that Diwali op Vince was digging into? I've got the address of a smuggling locker he was looking for. Uh, maybe he's still looking. Or maybe he found it some other way. This information, you... came by it how, exactly? The informant Vince was supposed to meet. She agreed to work with me instead. That doesn't surprise me. You're good at gaining people's trust, Adam. It's a rare skill. Point is, I got a lead. I'll let you know what I find. 